Welcome to a time of Bible readings and hymns with your host, David Kenny of the Wadsworth Church of Christ on West Good Avenue in Wadsworth, Ohio. When the moonlight glows, glows, how do you see this old world? Oh, how do you soak it all in? Oh, where did you come from and why are you here? And what does it all really mean? Am I just here to make money? Shall I just live as I please? I've been told that Jesus is the answer. Jesus is the way. Jesus is the only life worth living here today. I've been told that Jesus is the truth at all. Before this shall cease to breathe. Could it be Christ is my Savior? He's proven himself in the past by walking on water and raising the dead, ascending triumphant at last. Now I know that Jesus is the answer. Jesus is the Hebrews chapter 5, For every high priest taken from among men is ordained for men in things pertaining to God, that he may offer both gifts and sacrifices for sins. Who can have compassion on the ignorant and on them that are out of the way, for that he himself also is compassed with infirmity? And by reason hereof he ought, as for the people, so also for himself, to offer for sins. And no man taketh his honor unto himself, but he that is called of God, as was Aaron. So also Christ glorified not himself to be made an high priest, but he that said unto him, Thou art my son, today have I begotten thee. As he hath also in another place, Thou art a priest forever after the order of Melchizedek, who in the days of his flesh, when he had offered up prayers and supplications with strong crying and tears unto him, that was able to save him from death, and was heard in that he feared. Though he were a son, yet learned he obedience by the things which he suffered. And being made perfect, he became the author of eternal salvation to all them that obey him, called of God and high priest after the order of Melchizedek, of whom we have many things to say and hard to be uttered, seeing ye are all dull of hearing. For when for the time ye ought to be teachers, ye have need that one teach you again which be the first principles of the oracles of God, and are all become such as have need of milk and not of strong meat. For every one that useth milk is unskillful in the word of righteousness, for he is a babe. But strong meat belongeth to them that are of full age, even those who by reason of use have their senses exercised to discern both good and evil. Children, boy. 
you hear? Can you hear me? I cry to you with all my power. I can pray in Jesus' name for my will to be the same. For the Father wants to mold me in his image. For he knows what's best for me. If I'm bound or if I'm free, I can come into his presence with my prayer. Bible Readings and Hymns with your host, David R. Kenny, with The Church of Christ in Wadsworth, Ohio, recorded at WCTV Studios, with music provided by Andy Robison, www.churchofchristsongs.com. Bible Readings and Hymns has been produced by the Gospel Broadcasting Network. When the moon